jQuery rather um, offers you two different ways to set up your document. The first being um, <clears throat> the document already, and the other being the window.load. Now, um, so I'm just going to show you quickly how that's set up. Let's me. So you, you do this. This uh, dollar sign is basically how you reference uh, jQuery um, objects. So we're going to do doc oh, and function. Sorry, before I get cast. Document dot ready function bam and that is really and that every all your code will go in here the alternative to this however is the window dot load window dot load function done and um yeah so that's basically doing it you save it now there's a very well not a slight difference is there's a quite a big difference in when you would use either of them if you use um if you want the the elements your function to run on certain elements whilst the page is still loading then you use the um document.ready function and put your code all in there for when you for what you want executed at that time however <clears throat> You may notice when you become a proper program, no, not a proper program, not to take the mickey, but when you get more in depth into programming that certain things, certain functions won't work unless they're called after they're loaded. So if you need this to happen, you need to do this when I uh, call it in here in the window.load. This is when everything in the document is loaded. However, this will run if, let's say, documents aren't loaded, iframes aren't loaded, etc., etc., etc. But that's basically how you would load into the how how you start up your normal jQuery document. And um, yeah, so that is not much to it. In the next couple of tutorials, I want to just show you basically how to work with a few things. Maybe I'll show you how to uh, build a quick website or something like that. Um, but yeah, this is just just how to load up a quick document. Thanks very much, very much. <laughs> so I can't speak. Thank you very much for watching as usual.